Hello guys and welcome back to my channel for part number two of Life is Strange. So it's been about a week or so since I've played this and I've tried to read your guys' comments and hear what you all had to say. Um, I just want to remind you guys that this is my first time really ever playing this game. So have a little bit of patience if you could. Um, just because I am obviously learning how to do this and... You know, it's it's it might be frustrating, and if you get frustrated easily, then maybe me playing these games isn't for you. But I'm still having fun, so I'm going to continue on doing them. So, anyways, um, we are going to go ahead and pick up where we left off. And I also want to mention that I am wearing headphones right now, so I can't really hear what I'm saying because they're, like, really insulated. So um, if I am talking too loud or talking too quiet or whatever the situation is... Um, yeah, because before I couldn't hear when they were talking and then I would talk over them and it was really hard to listen to what they were saying. So anyways, let's go ahead and uh, start off by seeing what there is to find. Okay, so I'm noticing there is some stuff down here. Okay, uh, there's the miss, miss, missing persons poster. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and um, look at that really quick and see what this Rachel is about. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Wow, okay, so this is the same girl I think that we saw earlier. I'm not 100% sure because it's been like a week or so since I've played, but let's definitely pay attention. She has a tattoo of, on calf of a dragon and a star on the inside of her left wrist. All right, so she's 5'5", five five, 110. Okay, I think we got that. All right, so let's go ahead and go back and keep walking. All right, I'm gonna have her walk right into the freaking pole. Okay, these look like Sims, it's kind of cute. Oh, there's Stella. All right, let's go talk to Stella. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Mm-hmm, no, I think so. Oh yeah. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. New York! Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. Mm -hmm. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. <laughs> oh my gosh, Victoria. Now that you mention it, Victoria. Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. Hmm. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Mm. Well, I heard that from a good source. Hmm. So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting, actually. All right. So let me see. All right. So we got to. We better got, read Warren's text oh, before he blows okay. the phone up. Got it. All right. So cool. We actually have a phone with text messages. Holy crap. Okay. Well, stop texting me, dude. I can't read it. Okay. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? Any excuse us to study? Please make sure to check out Necromic on my flash drive. Mohaha. Hey, Mad Max. Let's bust ish up. Uh, wait, I have to study for a physics test. Okay, don't ignore this message. Okay, hello. Sorry, we're running late in St. Day. I'll meet you at the lot. Looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Hmm. Interesting. Okie dokie. All right. So we have text from Dad. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're now an adult, but you're still a little girl. Oh, that's sweet. Now, how do I go back? Okay. Uh, Kate, you okay? You want to get tea later today? Blah, blah, blah. Uh, Mom, happy birthday, Maxine. We can't believe eight. it's been 18 years, whole years already. Oh, that's so cute. That's her mom and dad. All right. So we got to go meet Warren again. Let me just double check. Uh, in the lot. I wish I knew where the lot was, but I'm sure we'll probably okay, find it. I better it. get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. So, where's your dorm? <gasps> Press tab to open your journal. Damn it. Okay. Got it. Um, I need to go to my objective. I need to go to my dorm. Okay. 
So do I need to read this or nah? Okay. Mm. You know, I really don't know if I do. Let me see. If I read it, maybe it would tell me. Uh, okay, I'm just going to go back to my dorm, I guess. Because if I read this with you guys, we could be here forever. But apparently she has an ass load of homework already. <laughs> okay, I'm not really seeing anything too much about that. I'm just kind of skimmed over it really quick. So let's go back to the dorm. Okay. All right, so I'm not sure if it's here or there. I'm going to actually try to look for... Okay, dormitory is cool. I'm on my way. See? Have a little faith. Who's this guy? I like your hair. I really like your hair. Uh, Evan? I kind of want to talk to him because he's just cute. All right, so let me go see if I can get closer to him. I'm going to look at his Evan's his thing. portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Mm-hmm. Yes, she would. Can you talk to Evan? Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Um, yeah, I really don't know. I'm going to go with Steve McCurry. Uh, Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. <laughs> McCurry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. Oh, damn. Should I try again, you guys? I want to see his freaking portfolio. Now I'm really, really, really I think his curious. Name is Evan. He always. Sorry, I have to get back to my portfolio. No time for amateurs. Oh. No offense, Max. Okay, yeah. How is that not offensive? Anyways, let's see. Signpost, look. I need to go there and grab Warren's flash drive. Okay. So let's go to the dormitory and I'm just. What? Left mouth. Oh, easy. Okay. Got him. <laughs> Come on, Logan, bring it, bro. This is actually pretty cool. I'm really excited. I hope you guys are liking this so far. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Looks like I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash. Yeah, I know that's okay. I'm going, girl. Stop getting sassy. Where's your dorm? Well, she would tell me where it's at instead of over here looking all kooky eyed. And now you're running into sticks. All right, let's go figure it out. Okay. Um, really wish this hooker would move. Why? Oh, look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. <gasps> what a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your oh. wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Oh my god. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh wait. Hold that pose. Oh, what a so freaking snatch. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, oh yes, my Victoria. god. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Oh! <gasps> Mm hmm That's the first and last time I expect to hear that. Okay, well, how are you going to get her out of your way, then? Do you understand English? Get lost. Mm, no thanks. Keep coming back, girl. No? Nothing? Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. How can I get her out of my way? Oh, ho, 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 ho. I think I have an idea. <laughs> I wonder if I can actually do None something. Shall pass. Capiche? Can you get her out of your way by, like, doing something vicious here? I don't think so. Damn. I was going to say that's way too easy. Keep walking, hippie. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay, so five hours later, I figured it out. Okay, let's see if this works. I just went ahead and tampered with the bucket, and... Uh... Okay, guys, so what I got it. <laughs> figured it out. Victoria, it's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. 
Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? Oh my Mila? gosh. Great. I can't even chill on the steps. <gasps> Let's watch, guys. <laughs> I am so excited. All right. I had to look for some help, though, live, but, you know, at least we got it. <laughs> no. Oh. No, way. no fucking way. Okay, Victoria. <gasps> Samuel is sorry. The pain is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh, wow. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. Gosh. Don't mess with Max, bitches. That's right. Let's go ahead and get back into our dorm. Since she wanted to be such a little snatch basket supreme here. Aw, so sad. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I am going to make fun of her, actually. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. <gasps> oh. And no filter needed before I post this. Ha <laughs> ha. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Mm-hmm. Mm, girl, bye. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. Really? Okay, so instead of being completely and utterly rude to the girl, uh, we're gonna go and actually comfort uh, her. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Okay. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. <laughs> it was. But there'll be another. Hmm. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. No. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. Yeah. Hmm. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Okay, so you let me in or not? <laughs> you deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie that was mean but pretty funny hmm. just one of those days you know i know exactly what you mean victoria i'll see you later au revoir cool well maybe being a snatch basket back wasn't the best thing to do and victoria uh, probably yeah. played me i should have played her better get to my room before i find warren are you serious? You just, ugh, oh, whatever. Well, we were, we did the right thing this time, I suppose. Last time we didn't. Okay. Let's go and find our dorm. Okay. Hurry, Courtney. Juliet. Victoria is going to be pissed we took so long. She just like ran into me, dude. How rude. <laughs> Uh, missing persons poster, fire alarm. Hmm, okay. Definitely might need that later. And this is Max's room. So let's go ahead and enter. Hmm. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Looks pretty cozy, I guess. Let's see. There's some clothes and cookies and a poster in a drawer. I wonder... I'm just gonna look at the clothes, it's I guess. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. All right, so we got I a, like my wardrobe. We got a text from mom, so let's go ahead and read it. It says, hi, honey, your principal sent me an email saying that he is concerned about your attitude and behavior and that you're not fitting in well and hiding in your dorm. I know it's hard to be away from home, and even if you are all grown up now, um, but you are there to change the world with your camera. Please call me soon. Can I? Do I have a phone? I don't know. All right, so let's go back and... Uh, go explore a little bit more um oh what the heck is going on let's see there's the book and bingo hard drive okay let's go and see uh where's the hard drive at okay drawer cushion uh high fee high five weird um let's see art books cushion Look bed. Maybe it's under the bed. Look lie down. I don't know. I'm just trying to explore right now and see what's going on. <laughs> okay. Oh, 
It feels so nice to just relax. Doesn't it? This day has been so damn bizarre, and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. <laughs> She's gonna take a selfie. <laughs> All right, so gotta find the hard drive, right? Okay, let's see. There's an achievement unlocked, red eye. Uh, this said something else, but I can't really pinpoint what it said because, um, yeah, there was something in front of it. Oh my gosh, DVDs, look down. All right, oh, I'm just gonna go on the laptop and assume that it could possibly be on there. I am so oh. addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Lauren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Cool. Okie dokie. Let's read it. It says, uh, Warren Graham at blackwellacademy.ed. Max, thanks for your email. Copy it from the class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I have also a, I also have a rather, ex whatever, a uh, collection of TV, collection of TV, cult classic and effed up films on a fat flash drive if you ever want to check them out thanks again for the help i'm a scientist more than i'm an artist and you can can you quickly explain to me how a camera works okay um still not seeing the flash drive which is kind of getting a little frustrating looks like dana left me a little post-it note I borrowed your drive oh, so I can watch some flicks while studying. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. Okay, so I need to go. Up Great. Now I have to yeah. go get the flash drive from Dana's room. I was like wondering. I was like, I'm pretty sure I don't see this. But okay, let's go ahead and find Dana's room and find the freaking flash drive. This is awesome. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Hmm. And it just gets better, guys. Let's go ahead and see Welcome what this is. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Thanks. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. Oh, I thought so. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? <gasps> Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Oh, Ouch. girl. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. Jeez. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, mm, crap. This is when you should have probably paid attention to the sign. I'm gonna go and say it's Julia, Juliet Watson. Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Aha. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. Good guess. <laughs> so how did you find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria, huh? She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go straight to hell. Hmm. Max, I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Okay. Answer you wuss. Ugh. So I gotta go to Victoria's room now. I'm assuming. Okay, dookie. So let's go see. This is. Uh, this Taylor is a slave. No boys allowed. This is funny. <gasps> okay, let's go find her room. Um, so that's the showers. Victoria's room. Got it. Let's go ahead and uh, take a peek inside, shall we? Let's go. Shh. No talking. Wow. Shh. It's a lot nicer than mine. A lot nicer than mine, actually. Let's see. Let's look for the proof. We are going to go ahead and uh, kind of dig on through here i bet victoria put juliet on her shit list after this article mm -hmm. sounds like a plan stan all right so it says is the vortex club a, uh, is the vortex club a cult by julie watson one of the blackwell academy's most uh durable and influential social groups the vortex club started in the 1980s blah 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 the vortex club started... okay so basically it's just yeah talking about the vortex club which you know, obviously pissed off Victoria a little bit. So there's a leaflet here. Can go ahead and look at that and see if that gives us any details. Uh, doesn't 
appear to say much. Computer, let's do it. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo and for this nice shot. Hmm, okay. Boom, this is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Okay, so it says, Taylor, so sad to inform you that I totally punked Juliet and Dana now. All I had to do was mention to Juliet that I saw nasty sex from Dana on Zach's phone. Dumb believed me, and so I expected there to be a dorm rampage soon. Ooh, Juliet deserves this for uh, slutting Zach away from me. As for Dana, who gives a... Mm. Get out your popcorn. <gasps> wow. Okay. So let's go back and let's see. Print the email. Okay. And we got to get out of here really quick. Where's that printer? Where's the printer? Okay. Go, 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 go. Hurry up. Take. This Hopefully. better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Okay. We got to hurry the hell out of here before this. <gasps> Dude. Oh my God. No. Leave, 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 leave. Watch, she's gonna be like right there. Okay, no. Okay. Go. We got this. I don't know why she couldn't just went in her room. Juliet, read this. Of course. Hmm. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. Hmm. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. <sighs> well, at least that kind of worked out, I, I guess. All right, so let's go get the... Almost uh, done. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Okay, so that's all we need to do here. Flash drive is on her desk. Got it. Okay. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. Hmm, that was just slightly creepy, but all right. I'm not going to judge. Let's go and get out of here so we can. Uh, oh, oh, we got a text from, from Warren. Cool. <laughs> okay, it says, uh, let's go back up and see what it says. It says, um, my, my camera will be ready. I'll see you shortly. I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. I said the more I text, the longer I take on my way. Bye. Okay, so let's go and uh, hurry up. Go see Warren before he has a freaking heart attack here. I don't know if this is the exit. Okay, yeah. Cool. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and uh, meet Warren. And I think after... We meet Warren, we, I don't know, maybe we'll end this part. This shit. <gasps> oh my god. That hurt. Damn, Aww. I better rewind. Why? Okay, where is he? Okay. Is this Warren? Fuck this shit. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, seriously, of course, everything is an issue. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. Get lost, hipster. Fuck this shit. Oh! Ow. My god, what am I supposed to do? He just hit her. Oh my god. Alyssa? Alyssa, okay. move your head. If you insist, Max. Oh, good. We missed now it. That's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Cool. Awesome. This action will have consequences? Why? Oh, and it looks like um, Victoria. <laughs> Great, just texted us. <gasps> Let's go find out what it says. All right. Uh, it says, by the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Mm, makes sense. I knew she'd be like that. All right, so let's go to the parking lot real fast. Hopefully I'm going the right way. Okay. Okay. What's going so on? So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. <gasps> Take a photo. Okay. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. 
Oh wow, okay, okay, okay. So we got a got a photo of him putting his hands on her. Wonder what we can do about that though. Hope Aww. you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Oh. That's sad. Okay. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. Mm. I could Okay, right. Well, we're not rewinding. We're just gonna go ahead and go through it. It is what it is. I've I, I've noticed that if you second guess yourself, then she'll go and say, well, I wish I would have done this, or I wish I would have done that. And I think that's kind of cool about this game, is that it's literally whatever you pick. There's no right or wrong, even though there may be a right or wrong. I don't know. We'll have to go ahead and find out. So here we are in the parking lot, finally. And I think that is Warren. Okay. Man, I should have done something. That guy was an asshole. Is this Juliet right now? I don't get it. How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? Oh. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Hmm. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. Hang in there, Juliet. See you around, Max. Well, hopefully uh, she figures it all out, I guess. Okay, here's Warren. So let's go ahead and... um. Go ahead and give him his hard drive. Max, get your ass over here. He's actually kind of cute. <laughs> what up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Aww. Thanks. No problem. He just totally got friend zoned right Check there. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive in. There's one Aww. in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then so am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. Oh, yeah. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Damn. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Hmm, <laughs> had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? <laughs> Yeah, we, yeah, we did. Yeah, sure. thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. We're safe seeing it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. <laughs> Great. How? No, that sounds awful the way you say it. <laughs> faster pussycat kill kill kill. <gasps> yeah. No, I that. was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. Look at the bird. Yeah, you seem <laughs> distracted. Uh, yeah, we need to I talk. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. <laughs> Tell cute. me everything. Okay. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one hmm. of the Jefferson's photo groupies? Oh no. I'm oh, one of his no. Oh what no. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the <gasps> bathrooms. Oh my god. You best tell me what you saw. Now. Answer me, Nothing bitch. Nothing but a butterfly. You're full of shit. I'd respect you more if you told me the truth. I don't need your respect. 
You're clueless. You have no idea who I am or what I can do. Oh, no. Actually, I have a pretty good idea of who you are. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh, man. You're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! <gasps> oh, my God! <gasps> Leave him alone! This Nobody is... tells me oh, what to do! Oh, my, my parents, God. Not the principal, that. or that whore Let in the go. bathroom! <gasps> oh, my God. That was so close. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Go, go, I got this. <gasps> oh Get my him, god. Get your punk asses out of there now. Don't even try to run. Nobody. Oh my god. Nobody. Oh wow, that escalated quickly. <laughs> that was Man. scary. Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. Hmm. Thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Why? Aww. Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I hm. thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, actually Seattle's pretty awesome. No, it felt like a real city for artists. <laughs> big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Hmm. We'll say okay, of course. Of course. It's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm we're gonna apologize. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Hmm. Gosh, way to be a hard butt, to say the least. <gasps> Wait a minute. What's this? What is she doing? Oh, her camera okay. got messed up. Oh, man, are you serial? <laughs> wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Aww. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. <laughs> my step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific, tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Hmm. Welcome home, Good Max. one. Awesome. Okay. I wonder what's gonna happen next. Let's find out. I guess we're on in. Don't be shy. At our house. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. Hmm. <laughs> Cute. Gosh, these some bad swear words up in this game. All right, guys. Let me see here. Wow. What a uh, what a room. Everybody lies. No exceptions. <laughs> My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. Think like a man. <laughs> it's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. 
Interesting. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to actually go ahead and end this part right here. I hope you all enjoyed it. It was quite long. Anyways, guys, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much all that I have to say. I'm actually really intrigued by this game so far. It's definitely interesting. Uh, I'm actually quite, quite, um, quite shocked, actually, by how detailed it is and how it feels like a freaking TV show that you can play. Um, When's the last time I had to dig through Chloe's crap? <laughs> it's actually a pretty pretty good game so far. Am I that into it? Ah, I'm, I'm into it, but I'm not that submersed yet. But I'm definitely interested in seeing um, kind of where else the storyline goes from here. So if you guys have any like comments or suggestions or anything, uh, just go ahead and leave them down below. And uh, yeah. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to go to comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know you all think of the comments down below where the sun doesn't shine. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.